we are going to be looking at your new plugin for Yoast. It's the Yoast SEO plugin, and we're going to teach you how to use it. Here we go. Okay. Oh, first things first, make sure you put in some tags for your post. That's just going to help site navigation. It's going to help organize a whole bunch of stuff. So I just put in some based on what your title was. And it took me a while, clearly. Okay. So, scroll, scroll, scroll. All these images need to be, have their alt tags, description tags. Okay, so this is what it shows up as in Google at the moment. At home face, facial, um, I've never edited a snippet. And I've actually, this is my first time using it, so I was just exploring. Um, for the focus keyword, I went with something from the beginning of your post title. Um, apparently, focus keyword just means one <laughs> one keyword. So, um, of course, it's not going to appear in the SEO title because it's three different keywords. All right. So, here I am thinking about what that actually means. Um, reading through some of this other stuff. Just trying to see where to begin. All right, so I'm just looking back at the post and putting two and two together, seeing what was written, seeing what needs to be done. Okay, so it's really about skincare in general because facials are a part of skincare. I put skincare first and still wasn't coming up with anything. So, bam. Um, pick one and now it's a lot easier to work with so okay keyword density is low you only use this keyword skincare twice in your post um, so here I am looking back and image okay so we got for the alt text it's got the price in there that's not the caption, that's just what is going to be shown. If the image was not to appear on the site, it would say Kate Somerville Skincare Goat Milk Cream. And that sounds pretty nice. I'm going to copy that into what the title would be as well. The caption remains the same, and then we scroll down. Uh, okay, what's next? So keyword does not appear in the URL for this page. Um, page title is too short. The slug for this page contains a stop word. Okay, so here we're looking at the URL. Focus keyword isn't in it. We need skincare to appear in the URL. Okay, so how the heck are we going to do that? Skincare doesn't appear in the SEO title. Hmm, okay. So, scrolling back up, um, here there's an opportunity to use skincare maybe one more time. So, let's see, where can we put it? We might have to alter the text a little bit. Um, so, yeah, I changed your blog post just a tad. Let me know your favorite at home skincare and facial tips okay so that got rid of the one that said you only used it three or only used it two times so you could put it in more now I didn't know what a stop word was so I clicked on the link and aha it is the teeny tiny little tidbit words. For example, the the or the is at which and on as it says on Wikipedia. Alrighty, that seems easy to fix. We'll just go right up 
to the top, the slug is your customized link. So just got rid of at in the URL and that should take care of that. Scrolling back down, boy, it's a long post. <laughs> okay, so, okay, that took care of the slug um, stop word, but it says we didn't use the, the main keyword of skincare in the title or the link as well. So here it looks like I'm looking at the what to do with the title. So at home facial, that's good, but it's short. So we're gonna add addicted to skincare because that is in the first line of your post. So I just took it directly from your own words. So, okay, we took care of the title, but we still need to do the permalink. So skincare, easy enough. All right, and oh, just one left. No meta description has been specified. And I actually don't see a spot which on in my template, I have a spot for it. Um, I'm not quite sure how to get that added to yours. But nonetheless, we got much better SEO for your post. Just go through, get your images adjusted, and that'll be great.